So he's been out there for six years. What is he doing here? He was just looking at me from afar. I can I started seeing him in the woods. He, he was crossing the streets. My landlord said that he was abandoned for six years and she remembered the people that moved and just left him. I started seeing Jackson at the beginning of this year. It was February. And winter here is really, really bad. So I added some outdoor shelters and a feeding station. I will go there every morning because I was really trying to get a routine. He will be there at a certain time for me to try to trap him. I tried to trap him many times. He was really smart. He never got in the cage. You could see the his eyes were irritated. He usually um, kept them closed. I didn't know if he could see. It was July 1st. I started to gain his trust. I got closer to him and I started talking to him. I cannot. He just continued eating. He just let me pet him. And I was like, are you gonna let me grab you? <laughs> and then I just grabbed him from the back of his head. He just let me pick him up. Oh my God, I can't believe this. I think that he was ready to receive some help. I was just so excited that I had him in my hands. I gave him the warmer and I gave him stuff for the fleas. I took him to the bed and he said that everything was fine with him. It was just his eyes. He was going to need surgery. After his surgery, I think that really changed everything. He can see now. He was so sweet. I could pet him that first day that I took him home. He starts moving his tail. He's like a gentle old man. He has all the calm in the world. He doesn't complain about anything. I take care of many other cats. I cannot give quality time. And just for me to know that he's receiving all the love, all the attention, that would be great. He loves to eat. He loves to sleep. He's just so gentle. He's ready to have a family. Anyone will be so happy to have him. <laughs>